Well, close to 130,000 people in Colorado have a prescription for medical marijuana, but very soon you may not need a prescription to buy marijuana legally over the counter in Colorado. Fox 21's Eli Stokos joins us live with more on the latest push for legalization. Eli? Yeah, Ron, two prominent marijuana advocates today beginning to gather signatures for a petition that could get on the 2012 ballot, the petition that would give voters a chance to legalize marijuana or, as the sponsors are putting it, to regulate it like alcohol. Just as there are now dozens and dozens of dispensaries selling medical marijuana to card-carrying patients, there could soon be marijuana retail stores selling a substance the feds still consider to be an illegal drug to anyone over the age of 21. What we want to do is establish a system in which marijuana is treated very similarly to alcohol. It is allowed for various members of the community, adults and so on, not for young people. The activist Mason Tavert and attorney Brian Vicente today introducing their ballot initiative, which would legalize the retail sale and heavy taxation of up to one ounce of marijuana. This is going to produce large amounts of tax revenue for the state, including money specifically earmarked for public school construction. Proponents say heavy state regulation will make Colorado safer and keep marijuana away from kids. It's easier for high school students to get marijuana than it is for them to get alcohol. So Colorado parents will be very supportive of the idea of taking marijuana out of the black market, putting it behind a counter. They're the first to sign their own petition, and they're confident that many Coloradans are ready to follow suit. Well, I think there really has been a, uh, a, a consciousness shift in the last 10, 15 years, and we've seen that medical marijuana you know, does help people, and, we, and they've learned that marijuana is a less harmful drug than alcohol. Now, these guys have 180 days to get their 86,000 signatures that they'll need to get this on the 2012 ballot. They wanted this to be voted on next year because with a presidential election, they say turnout will be much higher, especially among younger voters. In the bigger picture, isn't this just a question of when, not if? It may be. We say that about a lot of things, and, and that's possible. But I don't know if Denver's ready for they would make Colorado uh, pretty unique. Uh, and they say this is really the strongest medical marijuana law uh, in terms of legalization. They also say it would be the strongest regulation in the country. So you can look at it a number of different ways, but it would certainly make some national news yeah. if Colorado as, went out. To as we were wont to do. Yeah. yeah. yeah okay, right. Eli, thanks very much. Hey, do you support the effort to legalize marijuana in Colorado? Vote on the poll on our Facebook page. So far, most voters are in favor of legalization. Chatfield 